Hello YouTubers, diecast collectors. It is me, the J-Man 63. I think you guys know what date has passed. I just turned the big 3-0. Yeah, so there's a big haul involved here. Want to thank the amazing people for turning out. Stan, his mom, and everybody who showed up. Thank you, Sherry. Thank you, uh, Rachel, for showing up. Thank you for the turnout. It was excellent. Had a great time. Thank you, Rick. Thank you, Mom, for busting your rear ends to get the party started and going. I had an excellent time. Certain people couldn't make it. Uh, wish my best friend from elementary had been there, but... He was not, so he did miss out on a really uh, good time. So, sad to say he wasn't there. But there were a few people that weren't there even so. So, but it was a good time anyway. Um, not going to get too much into that, but I do wish he was there for the festivities. Um, yeah, I want to thank Robert. want to thank Stephanie for turning out. But this is going to be a big haul, so... Let me get into it. I did get some Amazon cards. I've been hammering out a frustration with Amazon, which has been a little difficult to say the least, but I'm getting it hammered out. All right, so I've been dealing with my account being on hold, so it's been hard with them. Um, so let me get started on the haul video here. Big thanks to my 800 subscribers who have been hitting my channel up. Thank you so much. Uh, Stan, Heidi, everybody who showed up. Excellent time. Glad Mom and Rick, Michelle, everybody made it. Had an excellent, excellent time. So thank you so much, guys, for hitting me up, heading it up, having fun. Everybody who showed up. Oh, just a big thanks. Um excellent time so let me get on into the hall I'm can't profusely thank everyone enough for showing up all right so first piece I got here was actually not from the party but my uh, neighbor's kid uh, just moved in got some new neighbors so they she painted me this she didn't even know it was my 30th but I gotta say um, she's an extremely talented painter this is a pretty cool piece to have I like that a lot. Alright, so next thing up here, I have this little fancy flashing 30 button, which is pretty cool. That's pretty neat. I have a Sentara tumbler. We're kind of going in order. I'm going to order this from the most common items to we're going to get into the more exciting stuff in a minute here. This Sentara Tumblr is pretty cool. And I did get this really neat hat from Myrtle Beach. My mom and Rick went, and this is pretty cool actually. This has the patch and stuff. Um, I don't know how to go in an ascending order. Um, this is the car that was actually on my Hot Wheels cake. Big thanks to uh, BJ's for making the cake. The cake was delicious. I've got to say, it's going to be hard not to devour that, but man, that cake is something else, man. <laughs> oh, I've got to say, that cake is on fire. Mm. All right, so we're going to get into some more exciting items. Not to say that those weren't cool. The hat's pretty neat, but uh, we'll save that for a little bit. I did get the Savon bottle, which is kind of cool. It's old caddy. So this will go in my Avon collection. Probably going to stop collecting these now. A uh, good possibility, but always kind of cool to get new Avon bottles. Well, that's pretty cool. I think this is a Cadillac. It's a Cadillac, yeah. Pretty neat. Alright, so I'm not going to get into the die cast quite yet. Get this Skull bottle opener. Always cool to have another bottle opener on tap in case you have company haha <laughs> no pun intended 
All right, so my buddy Stanley actually 3D printed this for me. It's a Model A, and you can actually put surfboards in it. My camera will focus. He 3D printed this entire car, which that's really, really, really cool. Something as a conversation piece, pretty cool. It's even got little surfboards you can put, and that was very nice of him. Um, rear suspension did get knocked slightly out of alignment, but this is just pretty cool for static display. This is just something you don't touch and you keep on display, and when I get this out of the bag, I'm finally going to put it somewhere where it's not going to get fooled with, but that's very cool. Put this on that painting. Okay. So, and moving on, um, I thought this was pretty neat. Rick actually got this for me, and I want to, I'm tempted to hang it from my ceiling, but this is pretty cool. Uh, this is an outdoor flag, a premium garden flag, and I think that's very cool. This original artwork, all weather, premium quality, that's pretty nice. I have to get clips to attach to my main uh, flag here, but that is pretty dang cool if I do say so. I like that. So that's another neat piece that I got. And moving on, and I want to talk about Stan again because Stan actually gave me this out of his personal collection. Um, if I can move this without disturbing this, here we go. Alright, so Stan gave me this, 32 Ford, out of his personal collection, which is very cool. I mean, all this stuff is pretty cool, I gotta be honest with you, this is pretty neat stuff. This 32 is awesome, the door's open. He had a lot of stuff, so it was nice of Stan to uh, give me one of his pieces, that's pretty awesome 32 right there. I like that gold. Alright, so we'll get into some of his hit the rest of his stuff well I don't know if I want to quite get into the 124 scale yet well we'll just get that out of the way so Stan really went all out and that was very kind of him he gave me this NASCAR now I'm not big on the history so do not ask me but I think this is pretty cool the turbine solutions car I, I really think that's pretty neat so big thanks Stan for this, appreciated very much. Awesome pieces, thank you Stan. And uh, Becky for turning out and Heidi from North Kakalaki, it's much appreciated. So, Robert and Stephanie came from the consignment store and Robert had already piled some stuff from his collection. Eventually I am gonna get some license plates but I got these Dale Earnhardt trading cards. Very different, very significant, pretty cool. I really like these a lot. These are different from what I had in my trading cards that I picked up from the convention. But these are pretty cool here. These are really nice photographs of him. The man in black himself. And uh, we're going to save my mom and Rick's most significant piece over here for last because that's pretty cool and I'm not gonna quite show that off just yet my mom and Rick did give me the skull bottle opener and the uh, Sentara tumbler the Avon bottle the hat that stuff but there's two really exciting things I want to wait until last to show and uh, Robert and Stephanie also gave me this this uh Good wrench of him on pit row. More cool photographs of the man in black. Pretty awesome piece here. So I do like that. All right, I'm gonna jump into some 164 scale here. Um, Robert had a personal collection of force cars, and I think he wanted a certain price point. So the first one here is a brute force which is pretty cool limited edition piece I haven't seen these just about anywhere so it was pretty neat to find these and we were talking about how lackluster that Walmart has gotten lately and that Target's got 
a way better selection. And in fact, weirdly enough, I got two Target gift cards, which I'm going to be going back there for more garb and stuff and more neat stuff. But this is Brute Force. That's a pretty well-known funny car of his. But that's pretty neat right there. Robert has some awesome stuff as usual, so it doesn't surprise me that he always comes through on neat collectibles. Oh, this thing did the judo flip on me. Hang on. This piece right here is the another Castrol GTX, and when I get this hung, I'm just going to leave it like it is. This is just wanting to flip over. Um, I don't know what kind of car this is, if I can get it to actually rotate. Uh, hold on. We are experiencing some technical difficulties. Cooperate you. There we go. Alright, so there's this one. Sorry, I had a little technical hiccup there. That's pretty cool. I really like that piece. Focus is kind of off here. There we go. That's pretty cool. The car didn't quite slide right. I got to put it back in there proper. All right, sorry guys, it took me a moment. All right, so there's that car right there. All right, that's enough of that one. And then I also got this John Force car. It's pretty cool. Another Castle GTX livery. That's a pretty neat piece. I'm not gonna showcase this forever, but that's a pretty neat John Force car. I like all this stuff here, so pretty neat. These are pretty exciting actually to get. Big thanks to them for turning out for my party. Had a really good turnout with everything. This other Castro GTX. This being the Elvis edition. Livery. Pretty cool. With him and Elvis. Pretty neat. And the last one we have, which is the nine time champion. That's pretty cool. Love John Force. Good drag racer excellent career his stuff is only going to go up in value um all right so now move on to the most exciting and i i saved this one for last because uh, you'll know why so these are not trick kites but these are just to fly on a day that i want to go out and it's windy since we do get the windy weather, but one of these kites I am going to actually construct, and I'm going to hang it up. So this one is for fly, and this is pretty cool here. This is actually a pirate skull. I think this is pretty neat here. And this is a... It says wiggle kites, and I'm not really sure what it says, but this is from Kitty Hawk. And you just fly this. This is pretty standard. There's no bells and whistles, but it's still going to be fun because I do like flying them. And it's a fun hobby. If you're a kite enthusiast and you like to fly, it's pretty fun to do. And then this one is the one I'm going to be displaying in my house. I'm going to be hanging this. And this is a pirate ship. This is not going to uh, get flown. I hate to say it, but that is not going to get flown. Alright guys, well, I hope you enjoyed again to all 800 subscribers, guys. I am appreciative of y'all out there for hitting the channel up. As usual, the Dirty 30 
yeah, excited, excited, excited. Awesome, awesome time. Had a great time, had a great party. I cannot thank everybody for being involved and coming out there. Thank you, Randy, also. I was going to say Randy for coming out. Everybody who did come, big, big thank you. And I know my aunt, my aunt is going to make her way down soon to come visit, so... I gotta clean all this all up, so I gotta go. My name is the JMan63, and I'm going to see you guys later. I got a video to upload, I've got stuff to hang, I have a long night ahead of me, and thank you everybody who showed up. It was an excellent time, big haul, probably one of the best hauls I've had in a while. It was a really good one and I am just thankful to everyone who showed up at my Dirty 30. Alright guys, see you later. J-Man 6-3 out. Alright, bye-bye.